Right guys, I'm playing uh, War Robots on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. I am using a DualSense controller. Like I said, I managed to get a Titan Pilot, which I'm very pleased about. I was trying to get this Pilot all day long. I have a Pilot on the Steam version of War Robots and I have a Pilot on my iPhone. And all of those Pilots are, well, they leveled up really good. The only pilot I did not have was one for Android. So I'm happy that I finally, I mean, it's, it's still low level. It's still like right at the bottom. It's Yangli, obviously, but I mean, look, I mean, it's better, right? My Titan now has a bit more firepower, right? So I will be playing, um, I will be playing, I will be playing uh, Fortnite in a second. Like I said, I did get a battle pass. So if I don't play games, What's going to happen is I might end up losing um, like my, I mean, you lose rewards, isn't it? Because if the next battle pass comes, you kind of lose rewards. You don't lose much of it. I'm just saying I need to restructure these uh, robots. Uh, this is what I do with all my hangers. So if I don't like the way the outlook of it, right? So this is a Crimson Hawk. I'm going to get this Crimson Hawk because that's in the fifth hanger. I just want them to kind of match. Um, this is weird because I think this dude should have been at the front, isn't it? He should be at the front, I think. Uh, what I'm doing is I'm swapping uh, robots from hanger to hanger. I know it sounds like it might look a bit dumb. Wait, you, you know what I want to do? Actually, I'll leave Nida as the first one. I'll change Scorpion and give... Uh, uh, Megalodon Orochi here. He's got Boombox Devastators. And then in the middle, right there, I'll put the Scorpion. Now, I know what you're going to think. Why is Scorpion in the middle? Um, I think because... Right, so one there's one thing here that I'm noticing. Those jaws are not good for the Scorpion. Because Scorpion is up close and personal. You understand? So, I need to change these weapons uh, from from Scorpion. Scorpion is up close and personal. It comes and then it starts to attack you. You know one thing? My mind is like, how do you know that it's not good? So, I've not tried with this one. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to use... Uh, in this video, I'm going to use different um, different hangers. I've been using the first hanger all along. There's three harpies, one opium, behemoth, and luchindor. I'm going to now use the second hanger in a match i'm just gonna use different hangers right now to make it more interesting the videos because if i keep using one hanger then it's not interesting is it so let me use different hangers i've i've i no, normally don't use these hangers so it would be interesting for me as well to see how they perform you know what i mean this thing is slow man what what's the ability on this dude Right, so I've got two Magnetas and um, Rhymes. I've got two Crimson Rhymes on this. I think how this functions... Come on, man. I can't even target this dude. I don't know if this guy's got like a shield on him or something. I'm just... I'm worried. You know, I don't want to get too close. So I'm feeling like he's going to die. Right, so the Magnetas should freeze this dude. Oh my god. I'm suffering a lot here. <laughs> Look at this guy. He's got a sphinx. He's trying to kill me. <laughs> oh my god. I just don't know what this thing is supposed to do. Oh my god. Look at this. You see, I'm not used to using these robots. That's, that's why. Okay, so do I have a shield now with this dude? I'm not used to using it. You know what I mean? Oh my god. <laughs> I didn't know what I was doing with that robot. I was just like, what am I doing with this robot? Ah, uh, this is Kairos. He's got Boombox. He's got Devastators on him. Oh my god, let me see. I've never used these weapons before. If these are good weapons, because I've got, I've got like four Boomboxes. I'm serious. On the Android, I've got four Boomboxes. So if these are good weapons, then I'll use them more often, you know? Wow, look at how quickly it took me to destroy that thing. Look, look at this dude. 
My other weapons are, are messed up, but he's using he's using decay weapon. What? I killed that thing. I killed two robots. What? Okay, so the devastators are good. Because I've got I've got a lot of those devastators, the boom box, I've got a lot of them. But I, I didn't think that they'll be good, you know? Right, so this dude has got chromoly. He's got a mixed bag actually. He's got a mixed bag, he's got chromoly. Uh, it's got geckos, two geckos. Geckos can do damage at 1,100 meters. It's the uh, laser weapons. And um, the chromol is the bendy bullets, the light weapon for bendy bullets. And the blights is a hazard weapon. Uh, hazard attacks your armor. Right, so that was a pity because it didn't do much, you know, that I thought. This is my Seraph. Right, let me fly upwards. Let me see. I need it to be closer, isn't it? But I mean, the problem with these robots, they're quite slow, man. But I've got two talons. These are cruel talons. These are the ones that they hit seeking missiles. So the, the weapons are quite good. The only thing I, I deny that's good is the, the actual robot. This robot is not good when it's on the ground. So you see, I'm actually hiding. I should be helping the squad, but I'm just like, I can't help it in this manner i'm gonna use my mothership ability i know this robot's gonna go down but i do want to help this guy i think he's got a he's got um oh my god we lost that thing anyway no i mean i wanted to help the thing but hemindale has never been a good titan in the first place hemindale is not a good titan i'm just saying that that's my personal opinion some people may disagree with me all right this is another capri i got toxins on this dude Oh my god, I've got toxin and blight. Why am I just getting attacked all the time? I just needed to hide. So blight is hazard weapons and toxin. The toxins do do a lot of damage. That's one thing I know. Right, I've got the mothership ability. Who's this dude? Who's attacking me now? What robot is... You see, the thing is, I can't tell what robot it is. Oh my god, look at this. Who's attacking me? I can't, I can't even see who's attacking me right now. No, it's an old robot as well. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, I just need to run away. Come on! <laughs> oh my god. I died! Crimson Hawk got me. Right. So, uh, boy, this, this hanger is bad, man. Okay, so this is Ox Minos. Uh, let's see. Can I... Okay. But I press RB. How come it's... It didn't. It just gave me the shield thing. I'm just wondering why. I got two pentagrows and one retaliator. Also, it's the other, the other one that allows me to run. Okay, that's interesting. So that's a crimson orc. Hopefully, I can destroy that thing while it's on the ground. Yes. So the pentagrows are like the gargantua. The same thing. It's just that this is the heavy. Uh, so Ox Minos is really good. It's a very good um, Titan. It's um, it's I always considered it more uh, as a uh, oh my god they're using mothership ability. I always considered this more as a an extra robot. I mean just for the size, the sheer size, and the fact that this guy can run. Oh my god, it's targeting me, man. <laughs> oh my god, we got lucky got really lucky the reason why i always consider this to be like a, a miniature robot because of the way he runs i mean look at this there's no other titan that we, that's on war robots right now that can run like this dude i mean they, they brought that robot the rhino robot the, that's a remake of rhino the um o ochi kochi <laughs> ochi kochi robot that's a rhino i mean if you look at the rhino that's what rhino was because rhino um could move quickly and lift up its tusks or lower it would it would have a shield and then when you got to the place where you're going to the person you'd lower your shield at the front of your rhino and then you fire all your weapons so it's exactly the same as ochi kochi and um, i mean ochi kochi is just a newer version of of that using my mothership ability again i mean you see this is why i like ox minos because it runs or he sprints, or whatever you want to call it. I mean, there's no other robot that does this, you know? So, I've got good weapons on this dude. 
but it's just unfortunate that he doesn't have he, he personally doesn't have good stuff on him but it's it is a good robot i'm using my mothership ability this dude trying to attack me with um, his thing i really don't want to fight a uh a, a indra because indra like i i have always said indra's a very good oh my god <laughs> it destroyed me Oh my god! I, I told you guys, Indra is a good, a very good uh, Titan. I hope we win though. I, I want to see if we win. Because, like I said, I'm playing with different hangers in this video. So basically, what I'm gonna do is play with different hangers. I just wanna see if we're gonna win in this match or not. Uh, that's the only reason I'm, I'm watching this. I wanna see who wins. All right, now nah, we, we won. <laughs> right, so I'm going to uh, tell you what I had in that hanger. They're not bad robots, guys. It's just, like I said, I, I wasn't really focusing on the hangers. I've got other robots, but uh, there's three Capris. The first Capri has got uh, Crimson Rhymes. Those are like the three uh, light weapons and two Magnetas. That's um, basically Magnetas are lockdown weapons, but the light version. Capri can only carry uh, light uh, weapons. Uh, Skyros actually surprised me, did quite a lot of damage. It had a Tiger Scatter, Boombox Devastator, and a Fatal Havoc. Um, so, I mean, that surprised me. It actually did quite a lot of damage. Uh, the other El Elderich uh, Capri's got two Geckos. Gecko does damage at 1,100 meters, it's a laser weapon. The Chromoli, this one here, the Chromoli is a Bendy Bullets light weapon. The Blight is a hazard weapon. It attacks the... The armor of the you know the the robot or titan uh seraph is the lightning robot the one that goes up in the end can target multiple enemies at once and this has got mk2 cruel talents but i did say when i bought the behemoth which was an mk2 it did come with uh, these uh, four talents which were all mk2s all right so the other elderage capri it's got two toxin like i said toxin is very good weapon it's like the cruel bane or bane same thing uh these are the prototype toxin but it's the same weapon uh the light and then the blight like i said attacks the armor of the robot so and in the background in the background you've got oxminos which are two pentacles and retaliators and like i said um it's got two titan armor kits Single reactors got two of those, one's level three, the rest are level ones. Uh, Pentacles, like I said, are very good um, weapons. I'm now going to hang a three. This one has got four. These are four uh, dread shells, same color. They all have Prisma as the main heavy weapon. But I think the only difference is the light weapons are, this one's got magma. It's like a shotgun, the very old, old, old weapon. It was the first uh, shotgun uh, light weapon. Uh, this other dread shell's got the chromoli. That's the bendy bullet for the light weapon. It's got two chromolis actually. Like I said, they all got prisma. Then we got one Eldritch Capri. It's got two sneers and two spears. The sneer is a freeze weapon spear. I don't even know what a spear is. It just fires every second, so I'm not sure. I think it's like that magma, same type of weapon. Right, uh, this other dread shell's got two geckos. Like I said, a gecko does damage at 1,100 meters. Could be used as a sniper weapon. The Prism does damage at 1,100 meters. Uh, that's a laser weapon. The last dread, because there's four dread shells. They're all the same. Uh, does have a Prism just like the others. So this one is exactly like that one. Same weapons. Gecko, Prism. It's just these ones got uh, two chromolis with the Prism and this got Magnum with the prisma magnum like i said it's like a shotgun weapon but it's an older very old weapon they have been upgraded since my you know i don't know what weapon it would fall under there's only one elder rich in here uh, in the background you've got indra it's got two lanterns and it's got one pharaoh so the pharaoh 
It's got three Titan armor kits, one Titan armor kit is level four. It's got an antimatter reactor, which is level one. It's got good weapons. Uh, the lanterns would block any robot or Titan from targeting you. And the Veron is just uh, it's the alpha weapon from the Evero. It's like that alien weapon that scatters. I don't know what you want to call it. It's similar to, uh, to Vajra, it's like Vajra. Right, so these dread shells are level five. So how much damage they do, I do not know. They're still low level. You understand? Oh yeah, with the dread shells, you also have to make sure. Uh, with the dread shells, you also have to make sure that when you use the dread shells, don't use the wrong pilot. Because if you use the wrong pilot, it can actually, it can actually stop that ability that shell got you know that that earthquake ability that sh i don't know what it's called that shake ability the one that is got so use the correct pilot but with this dude you can easily use him as a sniper actually because the weapons he's got do support um the 1100 meter you know damage so as i am like this at this range i can still do a lot of damage to this dude but i don't know what weapons he's using now so that one's not doing that much damage. I don't want to go alone because if I do go alone, I'm going to suffer a lot of damage. But the prisoners do do a lot of damage. If you've got an Erebus, you can use three prisoners. Behemoth, I could probably put those four prisoners on Behemoth and cause a lot of damage. Because I've got four prisoners on me. I might do that at a later stage because I do have a Behemoth. But the weapons I got on Behemoth, I'm actually happy with them. But I mean, just for the hell of entertainment wise, just to see what damage I could do. I could have all, four, I've got four prisoners, so I could use all four prisoners on the Behemoth. And the amount of damage I'll do would be tremendous, a lot of damage. But you remember, Behemoth, if, if uh, someone gets to you with a Scorpion, can easily destroy you because Behemoth is not a face-to-face -face robot. Wouldn't be able to do much damage to um, the scorpion. A scorpion can teleport in and teleport out. You know what I mean? So while you're busy attacking people from a distance and thinking you're clever, the scorpion only needs to come within 350 meters of you and simply hide. You, you understand what I mean? You'll just hide and then you wouldn't know, you wouldn't notice that the scorpion's there. And then before you could before you could blink an, an eyelid, he'll just teleport to you, attack you really quickly, <laughs> destroy you, and leave again, you know, and go. So, that's why I don't like putting prisoners. I don't like putting prisoners on... Uh, I don't like putting prisoners on, on, the, on, the, uh, on the behemoth, because the behemoth to me is not a sniper robot. It is easier, it's better if you just did that with, um, if you put those kind of weapons, my god, we're losing, man. I'll have to use this hanger again because this is a bad performance. It's a bad, we lost! <laughs> we lost, we got, we got crushed, we got destroyed. Right, I'm, I'm going to try this again because that was not a good performance with the same hanger because it wasn't a good performance. I wasn't able to use my Indra anyway. Right, uh, so like I said, I would not put prismas on a behemoth because behemoth to me isn't that good um, when it comes to face-to-face -face combat. It will be easier for you just to put weapons that you can use like for close range damage, you know, because if if the people realize, if, you're, if the other team realize that you've got a behemoth on your side, like this, you see that he's got long range weapons, but he won't go up to 1,100 meters like prisma. These only do about 800 meters, but they do cause a lot of damage. So if they realize you've got a behemoth and you've got sniper weapons, they're definitely going to target your behemoth. And if the other team has scorpions, like I said, they only need to come within 350 meters of you. And they can teleport in and teleport out. And the amount of damage they will do will be so much so that your, your behemoth won't last. It's not built for close-up damage. The one, the one I've done with my behemoth is I've got two crew bane, uh, one talon, crew talon, which is the rockets, the heat seeking rockets. Uh, the crew bane fire that yellow substance thing like toxin. 
And then the other thing I've done, the other thing I have done, you see that guy used a, used a scorpion. You see there's a scorpion over there. So what we have to do now, oh my god, oh my god, I'm suffering so much damage. Oh my god, can't stay here now. He threw down his remote so that's a, a mouse robot. The problem is, this dude is quite slow. And yeah, you see, <laughs> I got hit by everyone. I'm gonna use my other dread shell. This guy didn't see me, so let me see if I can cause damage on him. Look at that, he's not he's noticing. It's like, who's, who's, who's attacking me? It's like, who's attacking me? Who's hitting me? Oh, come on, man. Right, so I've got two chromolis, those are the bendy bullets. And the prisma, that's a laser weapon. He knows that I'm quite slow, so he's definitely going to be able to get this beacon. And... Uh, take it and then go to the other side but someone gracefully has seen him so maybe we'll we'll be lucky so i'm not sure so i think he's suffering from the prisma he's probably suffering some damage so he's probably going to decide to to scat you see what did i say he was suffering a lot of damage he didn't want to stick around i'm using my mothership ability on him did i get him no i think he moved he must have moved he moved from it. Ah, come on, man. Right, so basically... So basically what I'm saying is, you've got to try your best. You just, you just have to try your best with these type of situations. Oh my god. Oh, ah, my god. <laughs> just not working the way i thought it would be this this is probably the last time you know all i want to do is to get my titan can i get a titan okay so i've got my indra let me try with indra let me see if we can cause any damage oh my god right so i'm able to be invisible that's good Come on, man. What's up with these people, man? Let's let's attack these dudes. Let's win. The only thing I like about Indra is that at least he can be invisible, right? So, manage to destroy that dude. I don't know why people are using these old, really old robots. That mouse thing that's causing so much damage, man. That's why I'm trying to avoid the 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 the, the remote assault. He's, he's dropped it on the ground. Now this guy is trying his luck. Yes, yes, you can come here. Let, let me destroy you. What I'm saying, the advantages of this guy is that like once you know how what to press on the button on the on your gamepad, it's very easy. You know, like there, you see, he's attacking me, but I'm invisible. I'm going back in. I'm giving him a taste of his own medicine. And as usual, no one's trying to defend me. I'm like, don't focus on on the person I'm fighting. Just attack these people and kill them, you know. I don't know why people do this weird thing. They do this strange thing whereby they, they don't focus. They never focus on, 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 um, on winning. They just want the easy. They want the easy matches. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I have to be invisible there. I'm using my mothership ability. I'm trying to get this to That's the energy. You see, no one focuses on what's going on. It's, it's, it's weird. Okay, like, yeah, I do need assistance, but obviously this is War Robots. Nobody is going to give, offer you assistance. What's this dude doing? What's, what's up with him? You got a land. Yes, just land, just land, just land, 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 land. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Why can't I destroy this dude? Look at the kind of weapons I've got. These weapons are powerful, man. This is, this is dumb. That dude should have been dead. No, I'm serious. You should have been dead. What the hell? What's wrong with these weapons? These are... Oh my god. I can't believe that. What? With the kind of weapons I had. This is crazy, man. This is just mad. Look, look at that. 
a, a, a robot like this, now the robot that takes him out is, is a Capri, come on. That thing there was causing so much damage, could it do anything? No, utterly useless. Damn, that, that Evero thing, they, they buffed it, it's, it's crap, man. No, because, so you're telling me the Kraken Vajra is better. I've got Kraken Vajra, I can put Kraken Vajra, because that, that, was, that was a bad, very bad performance. It was really bad performance out. <laughs> I won't change the... I won't change the... What you call this thing? I will not change the... The lanterns. Because I think the lanterns wanted for. But that ever that overall thing was rubbish, man. It didn't do any damage. That's an Imugu. That's a, a little robot. It was about to die. How can... How can it not do sufficient damage to a robot? And yet, when the Capri came with the with those uh, blight weapons, it did more damage. Does that make sense? That's dumb. That's what I was thinking. That's just dumb. Look at the shell. The shell's doing more damage than than that uh, Indra was doing. Okay, maybe I need to change the, <laughs> the weapons that it had as well. But man, that was boring, man. I'm not using this hanger again. <laughs> I'm not using this hanger again. This is so. so this is a. The worst hanger of, of, of all of them. This is the worst hanger. Right, so I'm gonna change the weapon this dude has. That that weapon is bad. No, this this is a, a, a waste of time. Oh man, wow, what kind of weapon is that? I'm not gonna sell it guys. I'm not selling it, but I'm just so disappointed. If I had this retaliator, it would have done more damage. That's the truth. Right, let me, I need to get a different weapon. I've got a Kraken. Should be at the end. It's a bit slow when you're doing it this way. There you go. I've got a Kraken right there. I I don't actually have... I'm going to put this one there. I'm going to put Evero there. And I'm taking the Kraken. Kraken Vadra. I'm just looking to see if I've got any beta weapons. I've got those beta weapons. Those are the rockets, isn't it? No, nah, I'm not going to use rockets. I've got pentacles. No, I can't do that. No, I'm, I'm just thinking. I can't do that because the weapons are not that good. So I'm going to give this one the crack Maha, uh, the Kraken Mahavadra. But wait, um, I want to see what weapons Kid has. I'm not using Kid that much. Let me, I want to take out these weapons. No, you, you know what I'm thinking. Let me not do that. It's, there's a Vajra and there's that Fulja weapon. But I'm just thinking, no, that's not going to be good. I do have a Dazzler and this one. I want to see what else. Clave, a Retail, a Vengeance. No. The clave is a cannon and vengeance is machine gun, but no, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to leave it as this with the Kraken Mahavadra. I think that's enough for this one. But I was disappointed that it did, didn't do much damage. When I go to the fourth hangar, I've got three setups. Uh, one of the setups got the... Let me just go into it and then I'll show you. This seraph has got a Viper and a Rasto. A, a Smarter, sorry. Uh, Crimson Hawk has got two Sinister Talon, the Augmented Skull and Claw. Uh, this Seraph has got the Smarter and uh, Cruel Talon MK2. This uh, Gothic Master has got three Hazard weapons. And this uh, Seraph has got uh, two Cruel Talon. Just the basic, they're not MK2s. In the background, we've got the Maha Kraken Vajra. And two lanterns. Right, this one's got a plated armor kit, animated anim antimatter reactor, which is level three, caliber reactor, and a plated armor kit. Wait, you know what I'm thinking? I I really want to change those weapons, <laughs> but I I'm just thinking it's it's not gonna make a difference. It's not gonna make much of a difference. I don't think it's gonna change anything. I'm just saying, I don't think it's going to change that much. Make much of a difference. All right. Let me, let me, because, you know, Kid, Kid, uh, to me, is not a very strong Titan. 
So that's why I gave it all those uh, newer weapons, you know what I mean? But I mean, I could have taken them off and given them to this Kraken. I mean, to this Indra. Right, let's see if we can do some damage with this, if it's gonna make a difference now. Right, like I said, the Seraphs are not strong on the ground. So these are the, oh my God, look at that. Look at how much damage he suffered <laughs> before I even got to this thing. And then you know the bad thing about it sometimes, you get those teammates that just wanna push you in to, you know, to the section there because they're moving. You're like, oh, why are you not, why are you standing there? Let me give you a good push. And while he's pushing you, you're getting, you've been destroyed or annihilated by the other team. And then they, they, they always forget that you're on the same side. Some people do that just for fun, you know? I've noticed when I'm playing a game that someone will just come and start pushing you into that, you know, the section where everyone's shooting at. They start pushing you there. <laughs> I don't know why they're doing that. I wonder if they can see you, they can't see you, or what's going on, right? Let's see if we can do a bit of damage from the top. Need to help these dudes out. Everybody is running to the side. You know, the problem is I don't want to fly into it, but I mean, I, I can't resist not helping my teammates. Good, you see? This is a good robot when it's in the air. I never said when it's in the air, but it's good when it's in the air. It's just not good when it lands. And if you land where there's the enemy, like the enemy is right there, trust me. If they know you're in this type of robot, they'll come after you, they'll destroy you. They'll destroy you easily. A low key, a stealth robot, a low key can destroy you. That's why I don't like about this one. Maybe if you advance it to MK, like much higher. If they do the same thing they did with the tank robots and bring a pilot that improves the durability, then maybe, yeah. Let's see how much damage I can do to this dude. But like I said, once I land, now I'll be destroyed. He's, he's got uh, he's got cruel bane. Yeah, he's got good, really good weapons on him. The only thing I could do is to sacrifice myself and and try and try. I didn't even take the beacon. You see how bad that was? I didn't even take the beacon. Oh my god! I'm gonna get the crimson hawk. You know what? Oh my god! I'm gonna fly up. What? This is going on? Who's, who's, who's doing that to me now? <laughs> it's, it's that it's that nasty um, that nasty uh, thing. What do you call it? That uh, that that uh, what's it called? I just I destroyed that thing with the talent. I, I forget the name of the Titan. You know the one that picks up other robots. Ah, uh, Newton. That's Newton. I remember it now because I've got Newton on my. Um, on the Steam version uh, of this game, I've got Newton. It's weird, right? Because I've got the Newton on, on the Steam version, but I simply don't have it uh, over here. Oh my God, what's hitting me now? This dude, <laughs> he's using lasers. Ah, uh, you know one thing, his lasers, they lose power after a while. I don't think people know this that they do actually lose power. The more, you see, the more you use them. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, damn it. Jesus, I got lucky there. No, no, <laughs> oh my God, what? What the hell? Oh man, that sucks. But you know, at least I, okay, I'm happy with that robot. That, that one actually did a lot of damage. That was a good, I'm happy with that result. That was a really good result. The Crimson Hawk did not let me down. So I used Augmented Sculpt. I had um, two Sinister um, uh, Talon. So Talon are those heat seeking missiles. Man, I just hate the way this, this robot takes damage. Look at it. It's almost like you, you just start fleeing. Look at that. I didn't even make it across. Ah. Uh, 